about how to go there. On our sign at church the other day, I put, Jesus is your ticket to heaven. Amen. And I quoted John 14, 1 through 3 earlier. John 14, 6 is what I put under, Jesus is your ticket to heaven. Jesus said, I am the way, the truth, and the life. No man comes to the Father but by me. Amen. Amen. You see, friend, uh, uh, when you travel down here, most of the time, you make arrangements for where you're going to go, especially if you're going to go somewhere far away. You're going you're gonna to call ahead and make sure that they've got accommodations for you, make sure that you're going to be able to, to have a place to sleep and a place to get uh, take a shower and some place to eat and things like that. You're going you're gonna to make sure that you're going to be taken care of. Well, I want to tell you something. Every one of us, friend, is facing eternity. That's right. That's right. Yeah. You see, the Bible says that there's only two choices for eternity. You know, the world would tell you today that that uh, that there's a lot of ways to get to heaven, and that there's that that uh, that heaven and hell are not a reality. But the Bible says that both are. And Jesus spent more time talking about hell than he did about heaven. Amen. So there's only two choices for eternity, friend. One is heaven, and the other is hell. Amen. And you see, in order for you to make sure that you're going to go to heaven, you need to make a reservation. Amen. Amen. Right. And, and you can make a reservation. And, and I don't mean to, to be flippant or, or to belittle uh, uh, what salvation is because I certainly am not. But you see, when you trust Christ to be your Savior, friend, it's just like making a reservation Amen. for heaven. Because you'll go to be with Him. He said, I go to prepare a place for you. Amen. 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 Yeah. He goes to prepare a place for you. That's right. You see, hell is not prepared for you. That's right. Heaven is prepared for That's you. Right. Jesus wants you to come to be with Him. Amen. But in order for you to do that, you have to do something. Just like that song that we sang. To gain our admission, there's just one condition. And that condition is trusting Him. Amen. To be your Savior. Amen. You see, Jesus has already made the way. Amen. He's done everything He can do, just Amen. like that song said. He paid the price. He took your place on Calvary. Yeah. He paid the penalty Amen. there for you. Amen. He signed your pardon. Amen. And if you'll trust Him tonight and ask Him, He'll give you that pardon. That's right. He'll forgive your sin. And He'll bring you into the family of God. Amen. He'll come and live in your heart. Amen. Friend, listen, if you're here tonight without him, you don't know what you're missing. That's right. The first song we sang tonight was called A Bridge for Me. It was written by Steve Ellis. This song we're going to sing right now was written by Steve Ellis. It's called Someone Like Him. And the chorus of the song says, How could someone like him love someone like me? <laughs> Pay all of my debts that I could go free. What did he see in this sheep gone astray that could ever be worth the price that he paid on Calvary's hill to die in my place where amazing need met amazing grace. Tonight, friend, if you've never trusted Christ as your Savior, you have a need in your heart. And you may have looked all around trying to fill it and everything that you've tried has let you down. If you trust Jesus tonight, He yep. will not let you down. Amen. The peace and the contentment that you're looking for is found in Him. If you'll come and trust Him tonight, He'll save you. Would you stand with us? Father, we love you tonight and we thank you for the Word of God. Lord, we ask you tonight to move in this place through your convicting spirit. If there's one that doesn't know you as a Savior, will you speak to their heart and soul and help them to come and trust you tonight before it's everlasting too late? Lord, I pray tonight if there's one here that's not where they need to be with you, Lord, you know all about that. And I pray that you deal with that heart and they'll come and make it right with you tonight. Have your way in everything done in this invitation tonight. May you be honored and glorified. We'll give you praise. In Jesus' name we ask you. Amen. Your pastor will be here. If you need to come and pray, friend, come and pray. The altar's open. As Larry sings, will you come? Someone like... Oh, mm -hmm. 
Only to fall with no 